Well, we are back on the blue couches with Megan Duckett, the executive director for Because You Care. They have a big party for the pause, which is coming up on Saturday. And you've brought Ollie with you today. Yes. Hi, Ollie. Yes. Hi, Oliver. You were the one that was talking to John. Yes. So, well, he started it first. <laughs> yes, John did start it for sure. Yeah. What do you have yeah. to say to John? Anything? Big old wolves. No. No. Not now. What a sweetie pie. <laughs> uh, Megan, tell us about this event, which is happening on Saturday at the beautiful Frontier Park. Yeah, so it's at Frontier, right on 8th Street there. And Party mm -hmm. for the Paws is our biggest fundraiser of the year. So obviously, you know, we need funds in order to take care of the animals, yeah. pay for all their medical needs. A lot of animals come to us with injuries, um, you know, vaccines flea heartworm, all the basic stuff, and just the, sorry, <laughs> and just the basic um, food and wellness that they need before they get adopted. Yeah. So it's our biggest fundraiser, and it's also great to get all of the dog-loving community, animal-loving community together, um, just to kind of share stories. We love hearing about people's adopted dogs. It's just a mm -hmm. great chance to kind of get everybody together that's all like-minded. Yeah, that's perfect. Now you Do you have a lot of dogs for adoption right now? We do have a lot of dogs for adoption. We have probably about 25 for adoption right wow. now. Mm -hmm. um, cats, we have way too many cats yeah um, for that's adoption. the story all across yeah. the area and kittens but yeah we have a lot of great puppies that are going to be available for adoption um, a lot of them are going to be at the event um, so people will be able to meet them as well they're going to have adopt me leashes and adopt me vests on Aww. oh great uh, yeah to meet them yeah. Out but this is one of those fundraisers where your dogs are allowed to come right they're to welcome the to event. come. Yeah, okay. yeah, we want them to come. Yeah, yeah. if they're well behaved with other dogs, mm -hmm. you know, and you want even to work on socializing, we welcome them to come. Okay. We have a lot of vendors. Some of the vendors have things for dogs. It's my finger. <laughs> <laughs> uh, including different foods. We have trainers that are going to be there. Uh, yeah. So just kind of different things even to help with your own dog are going to be there. If you're thinking about adopting, what's what are some of the things that you need to keep in mind or make sure that you're ready for? Yeah, so it kind of depends on what you're looking, you know, dog or cat, um, older, younger, you know, kind of a lot of dependence that way. Obviously, the younger the animal, the more time commitment. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. Even with older animals and dogs, you know, training is going to be involved as well to get them, sorry, to get them accustomed. Hey, um, your poor pants. <laughs> to get them Come on, join Come us. On, Let's get go. up here. Come on. Just get um, right up here. Megan, like, I have manners, trust me. Megan, what I think is so interesting in, in nonprofit, not only are you caring for the dogs and finding them homes, but you're also working on that fundraising aspect, yeah. which mm -hmm. has to be like juggling four things at once, right? It's hard, yeah, it's really hard. And also we're working with the people too. So a lot of right. having animals is education because people <laughs> don't always know, you know, like when I adopted him, he was a very high energy dog. Had it not been for the no. trainer that happened, what? I know, right? <laughs> what? I, mean, I would have never lasted. So it's a lot of that education as well. But fundraising yeah. is is a big <laughs> aspect of it. Oh. Yeah. Oliver. It's a big aspect you stink of girl. it, yeah. We, yeah, we opened so that cute. door. Yeah, we did. Yeah. So this is happening Saturday, Frontier Park. Yep, from 11 to 3. Okay. It is completely free to come. Great. We have things for adults and kids. Um, we have activities for kids. <laughs> we have the WQLM PBS bus is going to be there, which is great. Um, and there's kind of things for everyone. It's free to attend. It's the whole front of um, Frontier Park on A Street. Starting at 11 o'clock. So, uh, yeah, go join it. Party for Paws, a fall fundraiser. You can find out more information there on the Facebook page for this event. Megan, thanks for coming in today and for bringing Oliver. He yeah, was a treat. Thanks for having he us. was yeah. sweet. And he's leaving a part of him he with me. He's leaving a lot of him with you today. <laughs> I take a part of him everywhere I go. Yeah. <laughs>